Hey there, Virgo. Hope you guys' weekend has been good to you guys. Appreciate you guys so much. Let's find out what the cards are saying and what's coming out for you guys' highest good at this time. This is going to be for my beautiful sign of Virgo. This is for Virgo, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus, Virgo. Tell about Virgo, please. Romance. Longing. One more. Contemplation. All right, so you definitely got somebody here that is contemplating on how to get the romance back up and running. This person could be contemplating on to get in the way of your romance here. Somebody wanted you to feel disregarded, left out. And somebody's still trying to figure out how to do this. So just make sure you're minding your P's and Q's. What's the overall energy for Virgo, please? Fear. So fear is an illusion. Punch it. Also, somebody that doesn't like that. Somebody is still trying to figure out how to put fear and doubt in your mind. And also, like, your romance. Like, somebody is trying to, like, put a cast fear in someone else when it comes to you. Somebody wants you to fail. Somebody is wishing bad on you. Careful what you wish on people. That's what you got coming back for you. We understand that a mistake is a, to learn from it. This is an energy that operates out of their ego, and they, they can't stand to lose. Somebody is wishing bad on you. Somebody is wishing bad on your love life here. Virgo. Your time has come. Your chance has come. So this person knows that their time is up. That's why they're trying to contemplate and like like maneuver a different technique towards you. It's time to step out of the confusion, so... Somebody doesn't want somebody to see something for what it is. And somebody doesn't like that. Somebody is trying to attempt to keep somebody stuck in confusion still here. The whole world is touched by your love here. So somebody doesn't like that you are looked up to and admired here. And the world is touched by your love. So always continue operating out that beautiful energy that you are clearly in. Unity and exchange. So there's something here about a group of people that's significant. Somebody tried to exchange among a lot a lot of people here. Somebody is still trying to figure out how to get everybody on the same page with something. Somebody still like like a whole group of people trying to figure out how to get everybody like synced up so they all got the same story connected. Hmm. Virgo. Independence. I am strong and independent. I do what is right for me regardless of the opinions of others. So continue standing in this energy. Somebody doesn't like how strong and how you're able to, you know, that you, somebody has to be in a crowd and you don't. Like you know how to be on your own here. So you do what's right for you regardless what anybody says and that's good. Something about magic is significant. So somebody tried to send something your way. Somebody could still be trying to contemplate doing something Sending something your way here, but somebody doesn't realize how powerful you are as well here. Sociability, confident in social settings. Somebody doesn't like that you have this easygoing nature and that you're able to attract the right people towards you. So somebody here is mad that you are leaving a, a group out, a, like a social group out, and you're moving towards who you're meant to be towards here. Compassion. I see the good in others and help them see it in themselves. So somebody doesn't like that you are an inspiration. You see the good in others and you help people see it in themselves as well. So somebody could try to use that to their advantage. So keep that in mind. What needs to be surrendered for Virgo? Surrender your attachments to results. The formula for success is to do all you can to make things happen that let go of the results. Holding on too tightly to a desired outcome can sabotage it. So this is about you putting out your manifestations. So this is doing everything that you can to make everything happen for you and then just releasing it and knowing that it's going to line up for you right when it's meant to. Surrender to silence. So this is about you keeping your silence with this energy here. Somebody could have tried to do like some kind of spell to silence you or block your throat chakra. That ain't going to work. So... Somebody doesn't like this silent energy. Something about your the silence replenishes you. So somebody failed. I keep somebody already tried to do something towards you and it's failed. Like there's like a whole I'm very drawn to this group of people. Like somebody really tried to use like a, a whole group of people to try to come for you. Tell me about romance. So somebody wants to send out a message. Some of you guys could be talking to somebody new right now here. 
Somebody here is trying to, to, to change the fate of something here. Something about you making changes in your life. Something about this... This wheel turning in your favor, your destiny is lining up, and somebody is trying to get in the way of that. Somebody is trying to figure out a way to hold you back. I keep somebody's trying to silence you. <laughs> Somebody here wants to try to come back and you know guilt trip you, try to make you feel sorry for them. This is somebody here that's like somebody has got a lot of bad karma coming for them for trying to mess with you this is somebody that really tried to put a lot of burdens and baggage onto you and you've laid that to rest here somebody here doesn't like how you are able to pull yourself away and like heal somebody's trying to figure out how to heal something with you through romance and somebody here is maybe sick somebody could be falling under some kind of sickness now somebody doesn't like the way that you're able to detach and just really be very selective with who gets access to you. I feel like a lot of you guys have went through like an isolation period. And it's like, how, how do you tap into your magic side more? Somebody doesn't like how independent you are. Somebody didn't expect for you to be not needing anyone. Somebody for sure thought that you was going to be lonely. You know, wanting to, to need to be around someone. And you clearly are not here. So somebody sees that you're definitely like in this energy where you're not to be messed with. Somebody did everything they could to try to slow you down, stop you. This energy might have been able to slow you down a little bit, but that's about it. Somebody is still trying to figure out how to keep you stuck. Some of you guys are in the spotlight. Something here about you just really transmuting this energy, pouring it back in to yourself. Like really like you could be like earthing, like putting your feet on the ground and just really like transferring that energy into the mother Gaia here. Somebody doesn't like that you're in the spotlight and you're viewed and you're looked up to. Somebody's having a tower moment because somebody tried to mess with your investments here. Somebody sees that you're investing into yourself. Your growth, your stability, is everything is manifesting for you. And somebody's panicking now. Tell me about longing for Virgo. Well, the person's spying on you, keeping a very, very close eye. Trying to figure out. So this person could have tried to do some kind of like love spell. Something to try to keep you, like, continuing to entertain, like, other options like you used to in the past. That's a side note. Tell me more about Wongi. Oh, this person did everything in their power to keep you restricted. Tried to bind you. Wanted you stuck. Fear, anxiety, doubt, depression, sadness. That's what they've got coming for them, man. Very deceptive. Very, just a very... Like, somebody that likes to throw rocks and hide their hands. That's what this person does. And this person's strategizing how to get you longing for them. This is somebody that has been waiting for something to happen, but I don't feel like it's happening. Your ships are coming in. This is someone that clearly sees that you've got everything that you need to create the life that you want. And something about the illusions, the manipulation isn't working here. And somebody is trying to figure out how to get somebody to take this offer, but somebody ain't going for it. And somebody knows this. Tell me about contemplation. Contemplation. Somebody's trying to get you to invest in them. It's almost like somebody wants to try to come toward you and say, Oh man, I admire you. You're this, you're that. But that's it's a facade, man. Tell me more about contemplation. That is the truth. That is the truth. There's something here about somebody mad because the truth is being exposed. Some of you guys are exposing some kind of truth over the internet. And somebody doesn't like it. You're closing out a cycle and opening up a new cycle here. And somebody doesn't like how gifted you are. Somebody doesn't like how you see through. Like your your intuition is right on point here. Somebody doesn't like it. Somebody really tried to create a lot of lies about you. And I still feel like this person's trying to do something. This is someone trying to figure out how to way to manipulate you. Trying to come towards you with like these feelings, these emotions. This is someone that doesn't like that you've taken inspired action and that you're moving away from something. Somebody's mad that they lost control over a situation and they're contemplating towards you now. Tell me about disregard. Well, this is somebody that tried to hold you back. They wanted you to feel left out, not good enough. And this is someone that doesn't like that you're now holding back from them. This is someone that did everything in their power to cause confusions, illusions, wanted you to feel left out, wanted you to feel like, you know, other people were more important than you. This person is now confused because they see that it's not working here. So somebody here, somebody tried to use some kind of spell work to try to make you doubt yourself. But there's something about you having this, this magic 
this power to you as well. Somebody didn't realize how powerful you are. Somebody could have tried to make you sick. Like, like no motivation, no drive for life. But this is what this person's got coming for them. This is someone that doesn't like that you are redirecting your focus and just really focusing on bettering you again being very selective with who has access to you because you're definitely standing in this strong independent energy right now somebody doesn't like that somebody's still trying to figure out how to keep you stuck and stagnant here so continue healing continue pouring into yourself and just continue focusing on um Tapping into who you are here, that magical side of yourself. I've got fire, fixed energy, Aquarius, Scorpio, Leo, Taurus. I've got Leo, water, fire, air, air, earth, air, earth, and water here. My only major arcana that I have out is this wheel over here. So somebody really tried to get in the way of your destiny when it comes to your love life here. So, all right, disregard. Somebody wanted you to feel left out, disregarded from these new beginnings that are clearly making its way for you. Somebody is still trying to figure out how to create some illusions here, but this is sticking up. So your shadow work is very significant here. Your shadow work is sh shattering these illusions. Continue doing your healing work here. This person has been spying, keeping a very close eye on you to see if the magic is working. And they're just going to sit there and keep waiting because it ain't working. <laughs> it's not working. It's going back to your ASS, Virgo. So we've got some unexpected changes coming in, some kind of cosmic intervention taking place, and there's some powerful changes coming to your heart space. So this is like an empress that I'm picking up on. You're reclaiming your power, and you're highly desirable, and somebody doesn't like this. So you've got two hearts falling in love. Somebody wants to put equal effort in with you. Tell me more. So there's something here about you just seeing things like, that third eye of yours is clearly open and activated here. Somebody doesn't like that you've got an eye on them. Like you see things for what it is. And this person's definitely keeping an eye on you. So somebody who's trying to still try to figure out how to create some disagreements, arguments, fighting. Somebody is not on the same page with somebody anymore here. And somebody has got some kind of obsession. Somebody is said that you had these poor habits these addictions is codependency but that's who they are and somebody's got this unhealthy obsession with you tell me more tell me more so somebody doesn't want to give up somebody's getting ready to try to come in here and conquer you somebody wants to fight for this and you've got this this old-fashioned love getting ready to come in for you so I'm like an offer of love and like this person's trying to get in the way of this so a lot of you guys have put out your contribution and you are receiving an offer here. And somebody could have very well tried to offer you up and it, it ain't working. Somebody else going to have to take that spot, aren't they? This is a very narcissistic energy. Living in an illusion, very superficial. I feel like this person tried to make it seem like you were these things. Like this person cares too much what people think about them. Like how many likes their pictures got and blah, blah, blah. That's what this person is. Man, this person's narcissistic. A narcissist. Virgo. Looking in your comments, seeing who's talking to you. That could be past and a new person that's watching you right now. A lot of you guys got people around you that act like they're your friends and they're not. So this is about making sure that you're cutting out these energies. Because you got some people that act like they, they're for you, but they look at you as competition. Tell me more. Somebody doesn't like how you're running. How you're running away from things that were meant to take you out here. And somebody tried to get this 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 new love. Somebody tried to get somebody to run from you. And somebody likes to copy you. Somebody likes to duplicate you. Feed off of your energy here. Steals your ideals and copies you. So it could be a whole group of people that's doing this. There's something about a dirty offer. Somebody could have said that you were a dirty offer, don't accept this offer, and there's something about you not taking this offer from this energy coming towards you. Somebody's going bankrupt for trying to mess with you. Somebody's bills could be past due here. And somebody doesn't want somebody to be into you. Somebody doesn't want you to have this chemistry with somebody else. Somebody could be trying to do like some kind of spell to keep you stuck to them. Somebody's a thief. Someone could have said that you were a thief. Some of you guys have some kind of like Somebody tried to take something that belongs to you. Like this is a thief of joy, time, love, finances. Somebody's trying to get you back now. This is someone that makes stuff up about you. They'll say anything just to get attention. Because if they talk about themselves, nobody's going to listen to it. So this person's trying to figure out how to hook you in with these feelings. I feel like this person's already tried to do this. 
trying to screenshot, get evidence and proof about your life, looking you up, studying you. So past energy, new energy, karmic friends. You got a lot of people studying you right now. Continue reflecting, continue grounding yourself, and continue going within and finding out who you are. Virgo. Somebody wanted you to be conflicted. Somebody's still trying to figure out how to keep you conflicted. Somebody wanted to make it seem like you had all these options that you were entertaining here. And somebody definitely tried to push somebody away from someone. Somebody doesn't like that you're avoiding them now. Tell me more. Somebody is trying to put somebody back in la-la land. Somebody is fantasizing about somebody. Your beauty is you're charming, graceful, kind-hearted. You're beautiful on the inside and out. And somebody doesn't like that you're looked at in that lighting. Tell me more. Tell me more. Somebody's getting ready to come in here and confess something to you. You definitely got a past person trying to come clean towards you. And I feel like there's like a new energy that wants to say something to you as well. Tell me more. Tell me more. Continue healing. So your your shadow work, your healing is definitely very significant. Because this is like, like this is definitely part of you taking your power back in the situation here. So someone was a easier... You were easy, easier to control when you were operating out of your pain and your trauma here. There's something about a commitment that's significant here. This person's like a new energy and then you got a past energy that's trying to get in the way of this. Somebody is trying to come towards you with this mask on. Somebody likes to fake pretend, acting like they got your best interest. They do not. Keep your boundaries up. This is somebody that... It's almost like that this person's got to try to get close to you in order to do something here is what I'm getting. So keep these boundaries up. Somebody is definitely trying to come in here and give some kind of mixed signals. So I feel like this person's been doing that already. And I'm telling you, somebody really tried to like really highlight your, your brokenness. Somebody tried to destroy you and you shattered into pieces and you built yourself back up. And oh, this person's very angry, man. This is someone that says some very nasty, awful things about you. This is someone that might try to start a fight with you to try to get you to react. So stay silent, man. This person acts like they don't do what they do. They try to hold their cards close to their chest and act like they ain't doing it. What well, we know, this is someone that doesn't want you opening your heart back up to someone else here. And this past energy is trying to pull on your empathy. Virgo. Of course you will make mistakes, but the biggest one would not would be not to try. You have nothing to lose. This thing you have been thinking about for a long time, just go for it. Better an oops than a what if. We are here to support you. So this is about going after what you want instead of, you know, always asking yourself, well, what if I would have? So go for it. This new chapter in your life is going to require a new way of seeing things, a new way of seeing yourself. You can't continue to see and interpret things with the same understanding that you have had until now. No matter what you face or how you feel, see it all from a higher perspective. If you are feeling stuck in any area of your life, whether it is in a job, relationship, or a situation, ask yourself, what is stopping me from leaving? Yes, leaving is scary, but sometimes is the right step to take. Be brave. We are right beside you. So this is about just removing yourself from anything that hinders you. So somebody doesn't like that you're getting ready to leave like a social group and getting ready to step into your soul tribe is what I keep getting here. So... All right, beautiful Virgo, that was your guys' message. I hope that it helped and resonated. If it did not, please check back with me on Wednesday. We'll do it all over again, guys. Appreciate you guys so much. Light and love to you. See you guys Wednesday.